Notebooks are used for experimentation during model development. And once a data scientist is finished with the experimentation in the notebook environment, models and the entire processing pipeline need to be deployed. So how does your startup, Linea, help solve that big pain point? Yeah, so Linea, the solution is based on a very key observation, which is whatever is happening during development, you know, at the end of it, what the data scientist is doing is simply extracting a subset of what they've already done. And 90% of what they do during development does not make it into production. And that is very natural, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And that whole process of extracting requires recalling dependencies, understanding um, basically the necessary and sufficient, that's what I call the subset of code that leads to that model. And this is not something that data scientists have the mental bandwidth to track while they're developing models. Their only mission during model development is to get to insights extremely quickly, and that allows them to train models that will perform extremely well in production. Right. So that means they are um, that means they're incurring a lot of technical debt as they work. Mm -hmm. Right. So that means that's why there is a ton of um, time that goes into cleaning up their notebook and pruning out the extraneous parts that were simply for exploration or for understanding, right? So what Linea is able to do is a couple of things. One is that we are capturing everything that the data scientist is doing while they're doing development. And this is not something that other libraries support. For other solutions out there, data scientists have to be very deliberate with what they save, what they record, whereas Linea is very eager about capturing everything because there's a chance that any part of this could make it into production. Interesting. Right? And then the second piece about Linea is that, you know, the process by which data scientists clean up their notebook, it's actually very mechanical, but it's very mentally taxing because they've done so much during development, mm -hmm. right? So what Linea is able to do is we are able to analyze every single line of code during development, such that we understand the dependency between all the different operations that the data scientist has done in order to prune out things that were not leading up to the final model for production. Right. So that's part one of what Linea does. And nice. part two is uh, also based on the observation that a lot of times data scientists need to translate what happened in their notebook, you know, that raw Python script that comes out of the cleaning process, the refactoring process. Um, and they have to translate it into a different framework. For example, Apache Airflow is a very common framework right. for running pipelines in production. And the translation process also takes a long time because these are not frameworks that data scientists work with on a regular basis. They are frameworks that data engineers love to use because they lead to stability, they lead to reproducibility, and these are very desirable for production models, right? So the process of translating is very onerous for the data scientists. They have to reorient their thinking. They have to learn a new framework. Um, and we think that's actually very unnecessary because the two programs are describing exactly the same logical workflow. And if we're able to understand at a semantic level what that workflow is, it becomes very straightforward to be able to translate between the two stacks. And that's what Linea does with just two lines of code. That's the really magical part about Linea is that it's extremely low code because we do a ton of heavy lifting for the data scientists in the background as they work. So by the time they're ready to productionize something, Linea is able to basically streamline all of the productionization software engineering for the data scientists. 